Hello everyone, welcome back to another Life is Strange adventure called Before the Storm. This is the prequel to events of Life is Strange in which we will play as Chloe this time. Uh, as a quick reminder, if you like my videos, leave a like or comment and click the subscribe button. I will be incredibly grateful for that. So just not to prolong this any longer let's just continue this great story I can't believe Firewalk is playing a show at the old mill. Fuck yes! Mom would kill me if she knew I was out here. Alright. Let's go to the party. Okay. Oh shit. Let's jump through the fence. What a bad girl. Damn. Holy shit. This place is awesome. If I'm gonna get inside, I'll have to get through that door. No kidding. Alright, we will go there, but first we can take care of our first uh, optional graffiti this time there's no photos but we will draw some graffiti with Chloe so this is the first one now what to draw and we can choose yeah what we can draw not a matlab or free candy yeah free candy Let's go. Recreational vandalism. Trophy urn. Yeah, free candy inside. Are you crazy? Jesus, alright. So, now we supposed to go inside, I guess. Bikes. I'd join nice. a motorcycle gang. If I had any friends. Nothing says badass like a nice floral print. Yeah, pretty cool. Alright, let's talk with this bouncer. Help you, miss. You gotta let me in. Check it. I'm totally legit. It's not a bad fake, kid, but you're in over your head here. Do yourself a favor and scram. Can't Come let him on. push me around. Should I go back and stand up to him? Or can that saw looks ancient. I wonder how long ago the mill actually closed. So we can s what? God, again? What do you want, kid? Huh. Your bike? Is that your bike over there? Yep. It's, uh, pretty cool. Gee, thanks. Is that all? Uh, let me inside. Right now. Oh. You started a backtalk challenge. Alright. 
I have to convince this doorstop that I'm not giving up until he lets me inside. In backtalk, you use arguments and insult to get someone to do what you want. Okay. Don't you remember what it's like to be a teenager? I just want to see the band. I thought we went over this. Isn't it past your bedtime? To succeed, to succeed, pay attention to what your opponent says. All right, bedtime. Uh, what will that be? Or no bedtime? Or your bedtime? Yeah, let's go with your bedtime. Ah, isn't it past yours? <laughs> Real cute, but I still don't know you. Cute, hey. I don't do cute. Yeah, I don't do cute. Look at my face. Do I look cute? Or do I look like I'm going to kick your ass? <laughs> okay, kid. I get it. You're tough. Alright. This Maybe one? Maybe I am a kid. Because this place looks like a damn playground to me. A girl like you? I can't protect you in there. Girl like me? What does that mean? Oh, time? Yeah, a girl like me? You mean a girl who doesn't take shit from a walking pair of biceps like you? That kind of girl? My boss will kill me if I let you in. Yeah, bosses suck. Bosses suck. Screw the man and fuck the rules, dude. Perfect. Damn. <laughs> You're not accepting no for an answer, are you? No. No. <laughs> and you really think you can take me? Yep. What if I had a knife? No problem. A gun? Don't care. What if I had... You could have a flamethrower, an army of robot ninjas, and a motherfucking dragon on a leash in there, and I'd still kick your ass. <laughs> I give up. <laughs> You're all right, kid. Go on in. This is intense! <laughs> Shit! Hey, Delia! Come! You dog. Follow the lights and the sound. Can't wait to get in there and thrash. Oh, what a nice pitbull. What's her name? Delia. She doesn't usually like people. Yeah. yeah. Me neither. <laughs> so we are the same. Okay. No. No, 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 no. That shirt is rad. No. 20 bucks, baby. 20 bucks? That's robbery. And don't call me baby. Fine. 20 bucks, thief. That guy's a dick. If I want a shirt, I'm going to need to get creative. No, 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 no. Hmm. We have to set this up exactly How to be creative. Oh, release the break. <laughs> yeah, let's do that. Sorry, dude. Maybe you shouldn't overcharge. Whoa! <laughs> oh, man, what just happened? Thanks for playing, Dick. Nice. Take a t-shirt oh, yeah. now. <laughs> sweet, sweet victory. That's like 200 bucks. Whoa. Let's take the money. Holy shit. I'm rich. 
Yes, you are. Right, what else do we have in here? Frank? Oh. Yo, Frank. Hey. Chloe? I know your name, you idiot. You bought pot for me every month for a year. Look at that get up. <laughs> Studs. You're trying too hard. What are you even doing here? I'm here to see Firewalk, man. They rock. How'd you even hear about this little shindig? God, the internet. How else? Seriously? Fucking kids. Huh. So, you come here a lot, or...? Yeah. Right. It's cool. I'm really glad you approve. Okay, so you holding? I could definitely use something to take the edge off. Of course. As soon as you give me the 175 bucks you owe me. Oh. All right. Toss in a dime bag and we'll call it square. Hey, hey! What are you waving all this kind of money here for? You really don't think before you act, do you? Nope. So where's my pot? No more loans. I'm not your fucking piggy bank. You're a good man, Frank. No. I'm not. Now beat it, Price. You're cramping my style. No, you're not. All right. I'll see you later. Whatever. Or not. I think we will see him later, right? All right, here we have another option for making graffiti. So let's do that and let's pick uh, Evil Eye, why not? What are you looking at? I see you so. <laughs> Trophy urn, alright. Strong guy, yeah of course. Push through. Here we go. Jesus Christ. Oh, fuck. oh shit, sorry dude. God damn. Hey. You okay? I'm fine. Relax. You bumped into me, remember? Yes. Yep. My bad, dude. You don't know who I am, do you? Nope. Don't care either. Hey, let me know how that works out for you. Bitch. All right. Mosh pit is a no-go. Fine. Yeah, so let's take... Maybe I can get a better view of the action from up above. The stairs. Oh, I unlocked some uh, new conversation with who? Like with this guy or... Oh, maybe later. I don't know. Let's go upstairs. Uh.
You spilled my beer, bitch. You should be more careful. It's a rough place. I don't like your attitude. Then how about I show you how unimpressed I am with limp dick assholes who get butt hurt over a spilled beer? She's calling us out, dude. She's gonna regret every word. Every word. Oh. This is gonna be... Uh, I'm gonna teach this little bump some man. I'm serious. You wanna see me get angry here? Because I'm getting there. And it won't be pretty. It won't. She thinks she can take you? Oh, man. Was that Rachel? Okay, what to do? Attack or run? Yeah, he's... He have a bottle. He can hurt me. Let's run. <laughs> In your face. Come on. Hurry up. That was a crazy party. Sometimes, all I want to do is shut my eyes and tell the world to go to hell. Hey, Max. Hey, Dad. Another day in paradise. Right? Yeah, just without Dad and Max. Perfect. Daily rituals are important. Even when they involve writing unread love. Alright, so you also have some journal. Cool. All right. <laughs> Last night, seeing Firewalk alive, the skeevy assholes, that girl. Was that really Rachel Amber? Smell like cigarettes and beer. 
Yeah, Better change I think clothes. that was Rachel Amber. Let's get dressed. Yeah. We can. Sh oh, whoa. Bonus outfits? Yeah, let's take that Raven. Yeah. Terrible news, but looks good. Millions. Our very own Pacific Steve's famous crab is shutting its doors. Might have something to do with all the health and safety violations they've suffered this year. You've had a near death experience eating there. Let us know. Can't leave without my vitamins. Vitamins. <laughs> Those ones? All right. And uh, what else? I really should get going. You sure that's all? All right. So let's tear down this poster. No more unicorns. No more princesses. And no more fucking rainbows. Yes, but another graffiti. Words Let's of do wisdom, that. Don't fail me now. Hundred percent of the shots or genius is. Who is the genius here? Hundred percent. Let's go. Everything's worth a shot. The last unicorn trophy urn. All right. But now we are leaving. Shit! Where's my phone? Oh God, shit! It's not here. How drunk was I last night? Chloe, I said breakfast. Guess I better try calling my phone. I'm With coming. Moms. I'm coming. I just need my phone. With mom's phone, so we need to go okay. to. Okay. Mom's phone is probably in her room. No. I can use it to call mine, then figure out where the hell I left it. Where is her? Oh yeah, yeah here it is. Let's call ourselves. <laughs> where is How my? How can mom look at this every day and not see what a tool she's dating? I don't know. Ask her. Perhaps she will tell you. Perhaps not. That is not your business, I guess. Alright, where was that? It sounds like my phone is definitely nearby. Alright, right here. What? Oh, I was thinking toilet. Oh, come on. There we go. Wonder how many calls I've missed. <laughs> None. One message from mom. And Elliot. And that's it. Chloe, breakfast. Bring my purse down with you, please. Yeah, yeah. Okay. Yep. I think I saw mom's purse in her room. Yes, where was it? Right. Oh, right here. Oh, and there's some ring. What's that? Mom's old engagement ring. Supposed to be mine. If I'm <laughs> ever stupid enough to get married. Yeah. Grade B. Fuck you, Arcadia Pond. Wait. Mom's selling her engagement ring. Why? Okay. So let's take the purse and let's oh, go down. I. Too? Yes, I no can. Jesus. Yeah, that really makes me want to hurry. So that's it. Oh, I made that? this for mom when I was like 10 years old. If she wore it now, I'm not sure which of us would be more embarrassed. A book? What kind of a book is that? 
Sometimes you have to get knocked down lower than you've ever been to stand up taller than you ever were. Blech. Don't give up on yourself. A single spark can start a fire that burns the entire prairie. Better. Alright. That kind of book. Uh, what else? I hate that she hides all our old pictures of dad. Yeah, what the hell? In a drawer? Picture? You don't deserve to be stuck in a drawer like this. Yeah, put it on the drawer, not inside. Exactly. Okay, so we have everything. I took the phone as well. Ah, oh, yes. So we can go down. Chloe! Coming, Mom! Coming. Finally, you can put my purse on the dining table. Might still have time for breakfast if you hurry. Dining table, here I come. Chloe, I don't have all day. Would you get over here already? I should see what mom wants before she strokes out. Yeah, what the hell? Hey, mom. You wanted to talk? When I send you a text message, Chloe, like last night, I need you to answer. You can just say text. You don't have to say message. And I need you to answer without the snark. Yeah, but I was sleeping. I was sleeping. I didn't get your text until just now. Oh, you make it so hard to trust you. Is that what you wanted to talk about? What is it with you and David? Always cutting to the chase. Why can't we just have some pleasant conversation before school? Hmm. Oh, engagement ring. Are yeah. you selling your engagement ring? Chloe, jewelry gets appraised for all sorts of reasons. Like for insurance. Nice dodge. How about this? You don't go in my bedroom when I'm not there. How about you don't ask me to get your damn purse then? You do realize I hate your boyfriend with every fiber of my being, right? Chloe! You don't hate him. He calls me girly. He's a dickhole. He can be old-fashioned. Yeah, an old-fashioned dickhole. Ah, right. School. My favorite. You used to love to learn. Yeah. I used to think drugs were lame too. I wish you wouldn't joke like that. It's not a Let's joke. It's not fight. I made you breakfast. Nah. I'll just grab something later. Oh, you'll enjoy this. The other day I made four eggs, two for David, two for me. And just before I served them, he says, what are you going to eat? Haha. Ha. <laughs> I'll enjoy that, huh? Tired, huh? That'll teach you to break curfew. What? I know what time you came home last night. And don't think you can get out of school just because you missed the bus again. Why would you assume that- Who do you think your principal calls when you skip? Do you think I enjoy lying for you, saying you're sick just so you don't get expelled? Hmm. And I do know what pot smells like, you know. She's not stupid, Chloe. Between your grades and your disregard for my rules, I see you slipping. I'm worried. But mom, the whole point of lowering expectations is so you won't be disappointed in me. Ever again. You're happy doing what you're doing? Fine. Keep at it. Just let me know so I can stop fighting with Blackwell to keep you on scholarship. Money's tight enough as it is. Huh. Maybe David could help? Yeah, maybe. Maybe David should start paying rent. He spends the night often enough. How would you know? You're never here yourself. David thinks you need discipline. David should mind his own business. I think it's great David's taking an interest. He's a good man. Maybe he can help. 
But he is not her father. Yeah. Dad was a good man. That's not fair. I'm glad your father still has a place in your heart. But sometimes we need to make more room in our hearts for new people. And sometimes, when we're incredibly desperate and lonely, we choose the absolute wrong kind of people to let into our hearts. Mom. David's had some hard times too, you know. If he's kind enough to share his experience, I expect you to listen. <laughs> like I'd let him get within 15 feet of me. When he takes you to school today, very funny. You will be nice, you will be respectful, and you will say thank you. Are you serious? This is such... What, Chloe? Such what? A bullshit. <sighs> Mom's trying, I guess. Maybe I should too. But what's the point in getting along if it means pretending everything's fine when it's not? But why it's not? Because you don't, you don't want to, to be, yeah, just be understanding, Chloe. Mom, I know you're dealing with a lot. Thank you. I understand you don't need me as much anymore. But I need you. I do still need you. You're my mom. I'm proud of you for being so self-sufficient. But the whole world's not out to get you. Tell that to the world. You're impossible, but I love you. I love you too. Mm-hmm. Okay, David's waiting. You'll need to bring him his keys from the ashtray. Try not to kill each other. Got it. Unless he tries to give me advice, or looks at me funny. Chloe. Or looks at me at all. Chloe. Mom. Have a good day. You too. Bringing David his keys is about the most humiliating thing mom could ask me to do. Oh, come on. Where are they? Oh. Here? Here no. they are. In the ashtray? Why? Yeah. <laughs> Let's get these to David so he can drive away. You were U.S. Army. Nine. Right, this will defend. No point in putting off the inevitable torture of driving to school with David. So we better we get need going. To go outside. Who texted me? What a piece of crap. The car too. <laughs> I was thinking you are speaking about the car. <laughs> oh, man. Why do you women always take forever to get ready? We're hoping you men will leave without us. <laughs> All right. Oh. What the? No, Mom. I swear he beat himself to death with a tire iron. What was that? Repeatedly. Electrode insulator's probably cracked. You know what a spark plug does? Yes. It ignites. Did you not hear me? I said I know what it does. You, you don't have to explain me. Set from the garage, and we can get moving. What is this? Quality time? Ugh. Better just get the socket wrench and get this over with. What's David doing, leaving stuff in our garage anyway? Does he think he's moving in or something? Hmm. I don't think so. What tool that was? 50-50 chance I smash him in the face with this. 60-40. <laughs> Maybe 90-10. Whoa, <laughs> that's a lot. <laughs> All right, and we have graffiti number four. If it's in my garage, it gets my special treatment. Yeah, what, what can we What message does pick? David really need to hear? Yeah, something funny. 
intruder box of decks. Now that's cool. <laughs> Let's Got pick it. that. <laughs> Home on improvement trophy earned. All right. <laughs> oh my god. What a box. Uh yeah, I guess that's it. Suck a wrench. Yeah. A little more hustle wouldn't have killed you. See what's gunking up the works there? That's a sign of carbon, carbon deposits. Deposit. No shit. You know, you could actually be good at this. If you lost the attitude. My attitude is what makes me special, David. Yeah. All right. Shithead. She doesn't like you. What? Accept fist bump? No way. With David? What the f What the f How you do anything is how you do everything. Now I need a shower. Hey, you're taking those tools with you, right? Every house needs a good toolbox. <sighs> We've already got one, but thanks. Hey, open it. Ah, <laughs> oh, shame. Oh, where are we going? To school? Really? Yeah, damn it. Ready to roll? Please don't want to talk. Please don't want to talk. I want to talk to you about something. Fuck. We don't have to like each other, but you will respect me. You've enjoyed enough of a vacation from having a father figure. So there's some things I want to be real clear about. Oh man. Ignore and shut this down. Let's shut this down. Respect him? I think it's time I show this asshole I'm not interested in anything he has to say. What's clear is fuck you. <laughs> Language. You are way out of line, young lady. Whoa, Language? I need four. He need only one. French is a language. Shemapel don't give a shit. <laughs> You've got a smart mouth, don't you? Uh, yeah, I do. Let me dumb it down for you. I mean, sorry. What has fewer syllables than dumb? <laughs> hey, watch your... I can crap bigger than you, got it? Oh, that's what I smell. A giant load of crap. You yeah, coming your out mother. from your mouth. Breaking what? Her heart. At least she has a heart. <laughs> At least she has a heart. All you have is... What's it called when you've got one porn stash and zero game? I was in the army. You will respect me. Bill of Rights, fool. Doesn't the Constitution yeah. say no soldiers quartered in civilian homes without consent? Because for the record... I do not consent. If you were a man, I It's I'd... cool. If you were a man, I wouldn't go so easy on you either. <laughs> oh, she's good. I don't know why I bother trying. Mission accomplished. Pretty easy. <laughs> oh shit. Poor guy. Country music. <laughs> Dad loved this song. I just called to tell you that I miss you. What a beautiful. 
beautiful day. What? A socket wrench inside a car? I know what a spark plug does, jerkwad. William. Dad, turn it up. This... This isn't right. Yeah, that's... That's a wrong photo. Huh. Oh shit. Jesus Christ. Hey. The hell? Out of the car, Chloe. You're gonna be late. Shit. Thanks. Don't use that sarcastic tone with me, young lady. I can see you rolling your eyes. Uh, hello? I was actually saying I see everything. All right, whatever. Warn everything. Hello, Black Hell. Chloe's going to a school? What the hell? What are you doing, Chloe? Jeremiah Blackwell. All right, some kind of a stage. Cool. Hey, Chloe. Oh, hey, Elliot. I heard you had a hell of a night. I mean, people are talking about it. Who exactly is talking shit about me? You know, haters on social media. Great. I wish I could tell everyone to just get a life. So, how about The Tempest? Blackwell Theater at its most pretentious. Yeah, totally. I know it's gonna be lame, but I was thinking, do you want to go together tomorrow? Uh, shit, I don't know. Maybe? I try to make it a rule not to go to school any more than I have to. But sitting in the back row and making fun of the drama kids might not suck. Right? That's totally what I was thinking. Alright. See you in chem. Yeah, for sure. Gotta track down Steph to pick up my DVD. I've still got time before class. Get DVD from Steph. Alright. <laughs> we have objectives on our hand. That is so cool. A Tempest poster. Drugs. Mess you up. Yeah. And something about something. Alright. Oh, who's that? Steph. Alright, so she is Steph. She wrote something to us before i guess but i cannot see what that was oh that's strange all right skip hey skip stopped any gang wars lately not today i did ask justin williams mom to move her mercedes out of handicap parking that ass yeah you know how i roll yeah so, I, I went don't to the know. mill last night, <laughs> cut Firewalk live. You went to the mill? Wait, you saw Firewalk? It was cool. Whoa, pretty wicked. I didn't know you were into music like that. What, like good music? <laughs> Preach it, sister. I'm in a band, actually. No shit, really? We're called Pisshead. It's not a big deal or anything. I mean, I mean, I'm trying to get our demo out there, but it's hard. 
Oh, that's Mishead, cool. Huh? Would you maybe want to hear it? Our demo, I, I mean. Sure thing. Yeah, okay. Great. Not bad, yeah. We got nothing, although we got something. You say we got riches. So, what did you think? Yeah, really good. That was really good, man. If Pisshead came on the radio, I'd turn that shit up. Oh, right on. Awesome, Chloe, thanks. No problem. All right, so... We need to find this staff and we will do that really soon but now we will finish this episode right here so i hope you enjoyed so far it's just the beginning but we will continue the story really soon need my dvd from steph yes thank you for staying with me thank you for all your uh, likes and support i really appreciate that uh, and I will see you in another episode.